People in Limestone County want answers tonight after hearing that the historical old Fort Parker may be turned into a trailer park. This is something many in the area say they're strongly against, but a county judge says this claim is just not true. Six News reporter Adriana Alexander looked into the situation and is live in the newsroom to clear up any confusion. Adriana? Chris Lindsay, all it took is one social media post to cause an uproar for Mejia and Grosbeck residents, but after speaking to a county judge, he says this was all simply misunderstanding. The post that they put out there with the purpose of stirring up enough heat that people would come to these meetings to complain about an RV park. That's the power of Facebook. In a now deleted post on social media, speculation of turning the historical old Fort Parker into an RV park took over the Limestone County community, causing major concern for people who strongly disagree. Fort Director Sarah McReynolds says if this is actually being considered, the county should take a step back and evaluate the impact this could have moving forward. They just want to know what he's going to do, and they want to know if they can get this historic site designation, and then we make, make a move. And that's fair to everyone in the state of Texas. The city of Grosbeck, the city of Mejia, and Limestone County own Old Fort Parker collectively. Limestone County Judge Robert Duncan explained how at one point the county filed a 501c3 to make Fort Parker a nonprofit, but that fell through in 2018 and the fort could be seen visibly deteriorating. So he came up with an idea to revamp the site and that yeah, idea was misunderstood. There's 47 or 48 RV spots out there. I said, why don't we try to improve these? And so I called her one day and I said, hey, I've got a guy that does this. I'd like to bring him out there and just look. We're not doing anything, but just look to get some ideas. Immediately, no, we're not turning this to a trailer park. And I said, I didn't say that. Now there will be a city council meeting in both Grosbeck and Mejia tonight. The hope is to iron out the details of the future of Old Fort Parker with county commissioners and residents. And we'll be sure to give you guys updates when the meeting does end at 10 p.m., guys. Yeah, yeah. it's a lot of history right there yes. in Limestone County that people come and visit, so it's very important. And yeah, a lot of people got their attention by what mm -hmm. was said there on social media, yeah. Adriana, thank you.